So there's a couple of different ways of doing this. You can look at the wine set there and the gradient, which is technically one, um, and do it that way. So you'd plot a point at five on the y axis and then go across one and up one and plot another point and do it again. You've got your three points or you just pick three x values. So the equation is y equals x plus five. And we're gonna find out what y is when x is two. So we're gonna write that out again. Uh, sorry, when x is minus two. But this time we're going to put minus 2 as x. We're just substituting it in there. So minus 2 plus 5. So if you go to minus 2 on the number line, you go right 5, you end up at 3. And so we've got the y value there. I'm going to do the same thing with 0. So y equals 0 plus 5, which is just 5. And then lastly, y equals 2 plus 5, which is 7. So we've got our three points there. Uh, so minus two is at three, which is halfway between two and four. And then we've got five, and then we've got two at seven, which is halfway between six and eight. Okay, lastly, we're gonna join them up with a straight line. I think it's gonna start here and go up here. And make sure it goes for the full duration of the graph. Um, because if it doesn't, uh, then you don't get full marks. Um, and lastly, I'm just going to label it y equals x plus 5.